There he is. That's a better fish. This is what I mean. This is a good one. Oh, yeah. This is... This is what I'm talking about right here. This is what the money craw does. It goes through that grass so effortlessly. That's a nice fish right there. This is why you punch. And this is why you punch with the money craw. I'm gonna turn this guy back loose. Okay. This bait right here, this is what I wanna talk about. It's got a, it's a, it's a big bait, but it's got a real slender profile. And the legs on this bait, when they move, they fold into each other and they stay nice and close together. So you get a real thin, tight profile. So what that enables me to do when I'm punching is use a lighter weight to punch through the grass. The lighter weight gives you a slower fall and that fish hit it on the fall on the way down. Where if I had a bait that needed an ounce and a half or an ounce, it would boop right past the fish and I may not have gotten that bite. That's why, you know, that's why I just love this bait for this technique, especially if the mats are broken up like you see here, they're kind of spotty. And so basically I'm just targeting where they all come together and they make a nice clump. The money crop, it gets the job done in this kind of scenario.